Hi, my name is Dana. I'm an international psychic medium and a professional tarot card reader. I have clients all over the world that come to me consistently for the ancient spiritual wisdom and guidance of the tarot. I have a very straightforward, refreshing perspective about the tarot, and I've created this video series in hopes of harvesting tarot card readers that can also bring a real and fresh perspective to the craft. Tarot School Module 1 is designed to get you up and running to teach you how to understand and read the tarot with plenty of room for your own personalization. Hey everyone, it's Dana with Deep Thoughts with Dana and welcome to Tarot School. I am super proud that you have decided to explore your psychic abilities through the tarot. The tarot has changed my life and I guarantee you, buckle up because by the time you're finished with this series and you understand inside and out what the tarot is about, it too will change your life as well. This is an introductory video series about the tarot. It's very basic and simple, but yet it's extremely deep and profound. What I'm focusing on in this, in this tarot school video series is getting you to internalize the meanings of the cards, okay? It's the absolute most important thing that you can do as a tarot card reader is, is make these cards part of the fiber of who you are okay and we're going to go through all 78 of the cards and we are going to talk about their meaning in depth tarot. i'm going to teach you how to read the cards but the intuitive psychic part of it is all you it's all up to you and it's all your own gifting that you are going to procure and develop through the tarot cards Module 1 is an introductory course. We're going to cover all 78 cards of the tarot, starting with the major arcana and going into the earth energy, then the water energy, the fire energy, and then the air energy. So you can internalize and understand what each and every card means to you personally, because you're going to internalize these cards. You are going to make these cards your own. I'm going to give you the root definitions, and we're going to talk about the meaning meaning of each card, but as we do this, these cards are going to become your cards and they're going to help you to become a tarot card reader. The Queen of Swords. I love her. A woman after my own heart, the Queen of Swords is. <laughs> her definition, intelligent, perceptive, independent. She's stern, but she's flexible. She's factual, she's logical, she's reasonable. She uses a lot of intellect to, to make her decisions and she is about truth and justice. This woman, she'll hear you out. She absolutely will. She will hear you out. And she may, she may entertain what you have to say. But don't be surprised if she cuts you off at the knees and turns around and walks away. Don't be surprised if what you have to say to this Queen of Swords falls on deaf ears and she turns on her heels and walks away. That's the energy of the Queen of Swords. It is a no bullshit kind of card. You either come to me right and proper or don't come to me at all. Don't come up in my Queen of Swords space spewing bullshit because I can see right through it and I will not tolerate it. That is the Queen of Swords. Truth, honesty, and fairness. When this card comes up in a reading, it's either a personality or it is the energy of this Queen of Swords. In reverse, she's overly emotional, right? Because in the upright, she's stern and, and emotionless, right? Um, she's overly emotional. She can be really bitchy. She can be cold-hearted, and she can be overly stern. She's about withdrawing her emotions and being angry when she's in the reverse. The King of Swords, the counterpart to the Queen of Swords. Now, the King of Swords, he's not going to listen. He does not have the feminine energy of the Queen of Swords, right? This is the buck stops here. I will throw this sword down on you and not think twice about it, right? You don't even consider discussing something with the King of Swords. You don't. You do what the King of Swords says.